If you're very observant, you might notice the shape of these legs I copied from my Jetsons wall clock. I'm gonna start by edge jointing and gluing up panels for the legs and the tabletop. I made up a template for the legs and I'm cutting them out all at once on my bandsaw. I glued up three pieces of wood to make a block that all four of the legs are gonna fit into. I'm drilling a three quarter inch hole partially through this block. I'm gonna use this longer bit to go all the way through for the lamp cord. And now I can round over all the edges on the legs. I've cut this really thin board to cap off the end grain on the center support. Here's one of those woodworking moments that just leaves me scratching my head. This is my test piece I did to make those dados, which gave me a very nice fit. But without changing anything in my router setup, this is the fit I have on this piece. <laughs> huh. Iron on edge banding to the rescue. Okay. Perfect. Okay. My table saw will make a nice flat surface to glue this up and make sure that all four legs are level. Morning. To cut out the circle for the tabletop, I've made up this quick sled for my table saw. It's just got two runners on a sheet of three quarter inch plywood. I want my tabletop to have a 15 inch diameter, so I'm gonna mark off a seven and a half inch radius. Now just drill a pilot hole into that mark. This is my cherry blank glued up for the top, so I'll just need to find the center point and drill a hole through that. I'll put a screw in there just until I can feel the point sticking out of the back. Now I can line it up with that hole I made earlier and drop it in. I just want it tight enough that it stays in but still spins. into the top of each of the legs. I'm just gluing some dowels into these holes. I can drill the three quarter inch hole in the center of the tabletop. I cut a short piece of pipe to help me line this up. Okay. this small circle out using a hole saw and now I'm putting a three quarter inch hole in the center of it. And I'm drilling three holes through the edges of this. I'm gonna glue this thing to the underside of the table. And finally I can glue the legs on. This is half inch steel conduit that I'm spray painting silver. I'm gonna finish this with a few coats of brushing lacquer. These three screws will tighten down that hole and also lets me level it back and forth a little bit, make sure it's straight. This lamp cord will run all the way up through the conduit. I'm gonna hold it in with just a little bit of epoxy. And I just wire this onto the socket. Well, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure and like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel where I have new woodworking videos every Friday. And visit my website at woodworkingfornearmortals.com and you can also find me over on Facebook and Twitter. Just check in the description box for all those links and I'll see you next week.